Alright, I bought a tree stand for some public land and I went on the kind of cheaper side, but it got great reviews, it looks good, and actually looks super comfortable. So take a look at it. Bought it from Academy. It was ninety dollars. So Still expensive, but you can get some pretty nice ones for about three hundred dollars, sometimes more. But uh, let's open it up and uh, start to put it together. Here we go. All right, everything that came out of the box. Uh, so it's the seat and also a harness. Right there, with the lineman's belt, uh, which is awesome. The destructions. And then also a set of ratchet straps, which is even better because now I don't have to go and buy any. And then obviously the seat. So, it also came with its own tools. So everything you need is right here, which is awesome. Uh, so, let's go ahead and start putting it together. All right. So, every here's everything: up the tree brace, wrenches, the uh, seat frame. brace and then your uh, platform and the rest of the assembly that's right, super windy right now but first what we're gonna do is put the uh, the seat onto the backrest of the uh, platform Gonna take something off that was already set the way it should go, put it back on the way it should go. So, put that little washer in there first and fitted the one right there. And I just put that all together so that way I'm not losing anything. Now I'm going to put this one on the same way I did this right here. So, Another good thing to remember is plastic to plastic, metal to metal, as I drop it.
There we go. Now I'm going to tighten them down. I don't want them too tight just because I don't want to bust any of these bushings. So, yeah, you see how those are tight. And these are lock washer or lock nuts too, so I don't have to worry too much about that. tight but not too tight just to where they got snug so see if it just falls right down all right now I'm gonna install the backrest support so make sure we can get this good There, we got the nut, the washer on the other side. We're gonna tighten them down. All right, now the upper tree brace right here. All right, so I don't know what happened, but apparently the last little bit of me putting together the tree stand didn't go through. Anyways, it's not a big deal. Um, the, it's fantastic. My buddy has a, um, a hawk, a $250 hawk tree stand, which is basically the same thing as the one I just put together and purchased. Um, I use that in West Texas for my mule deer hunt. I'll have some video rolling right now of me sitting in it. Uh, <clears throat> super comfortable. I sat in that thing for hours. I think it was five hours total we sat uh, for the mule deer. But super comfortable, uh, super affordable, especially if you're looking into getting something. The only issue I would say would be to get a different harness because the harness that it comes with is one of those uncomfortable ones that you have to almost step into and then set up right and throw over your shoulders just perfect and it's it's just really uncomfortable especially on cold days um, splurge go and spend eighty hundred dollars hundred twenty dollars on one of the nice vest ones that you can just put through your legs and then zip up like an actual vest uh, so much easier and so much more comfortable but uh, that's all I got uh, this stand gets an A plus rating for me uh, five well I'll say four and a half stars only because of the harness but it comes with a harness so I can't complain too much there uh, fantastic stand very comfortable the seat super comfortable the lumbar support perfect anyways that's all I got uh, and uh, I'll try and leave a link to uh, where I bought it from. I don't know if they still have it in stock, but anyways, um, I bought it from Academy, which is my local sporting goods store. And <clears throat> other than that, uh, it was fantastic. I would definitely buy it again, and I really hope to use it on public land this coming year. Um, so that's all I got. Uh, thanks for watching, and 